Well, it's been three months since the FIFA World Cup in Qatar ended, and incredibly, we're still being contacted by workers from Africa and Asia about unpaid wages, injuries, discrimination, and other things that they need to be compensated. These are the women and men who made the tournament, while FIFA made $7.5 billion, Qatar made $17.5 billion. For the past three years, I've been engaged in investigations with ECUDEM. Uh, we've now talked to more than 1,000 workers whose cases represent many more who are to be compensated. Um, these are workers who were not paid for the work they did, uh, workers who sustained injuries uh, due to unsafe working conditions. These are families who lost their loved ones, uh, all to make the work possible. We are trying to see what workers experienced during the World Cup and possible violations because a lot of workers went through challenges during the World Cup. Well, it's a more good um, first a little more 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 of a good as a very good arutation. My daughter, my boy, a good arutation. Bull Nemo Cadino or my bull leg or Latin modest to the American Gorney, there is at here, Lebony, Marley, Bull Nazi, it's a hound wire, a more market, there is at here, this is Cotarmas, there is a pound by go, one you say, Lady Nordi Nazia, that is a staple in Gorney. Our message to FIFA is really simple. Uh, if you can make billions of dollars in profit, if you're able to pay millions of dollars to footballers, why can't you make sure that workers are paid what they're owed? Support Equidem as we track down the thousands of workers who are owed compensation and we hold them to account.